Seattle University has a lot of study abroad opportunities. The one that I chose is called the U International Development Internship Program, which is a very unique program offered to undergraduate students. Really, my professor told me it's the only one like it uh, in the United States for undergraduate students. And what that does is it allows you to have an internship with a nonprofit in a developing country for a quarter, and you receive 15 credits worth going towards your degree. I think it's, it's extremely important uh, what a study tour can do for a student no classroom simulation can ever provide. Um, there could be simple things like how to study in a classroom where there is, where there is a power cut or how to study in, very, um, in, in, in conditions where computers don't sometimes work or how to study or get lectured by uh, people who may not have the same view of the world as you might have. When you study abroad, you really learn a lot about another culture's business perspective. Um, they have, I mean, they have different values, uh, there's a different language, uh, there's different um, objectives and goals that they have for their business, and so when you study abroad, uh, you're just getting out of the norm because the world is global and it's it's rapidly changing and it's moving and it's all international business is international. Students who have had a study abroad experience do come back again both understanding that America is a place where we have a lot of riches other people don't have those kinds of riches so they come back understanding that. They are also able to see, I think, part of our entrepreneurship program. Students are able to see how uh, small businesses can really help change the lives of people and want to help participate in the process of designing or helping to create business plans for small businesses in other parts of the world. And so, yes, I think it helps them to learn how to apply the things that they've learned in school to the real world in, in a way that you don't do when you're in an internship in the United States. Mm -hmm.